The 2017 draft class was a really interesting one as there was a lot of unknowns at the quarterback position. Mitch Trubisky was the second pick overall in the draft. Meanwhile, we were introduced to Patrick Mahomes and Deshaun Watson. There's some really obviously good defensive talent in this draft, such as Jamal Adams, who came into the NFL right away and was great. But the one question mark in this draft was the offensive line talent. There really wasn't any. There was only two offensive linemen drafted in the entire first round. And throughout the entire draft, it was a historical low number for the amount of offensive linemen drafted. And I remember watching on the night of the draft and the first offensive lineman finally went off the board with the 20th pick and once I heard his story the red flags just went off for me and I was like no way this guy is going to be good his name was Garrett Bowles and he was drafted at 25 years old and it's very rare to find somebody past the age of 24 be drafted in the first round just because his physical peak and potential by the time he really meets it he's going to be older and his body's already going to be breaking down so when you draft a 25 year old By the time his rookie contract ends, he's going to be 29 years old. So you want him to be good right away. And this guy, Garrett Bowles, they were talking about his backstory, about how he was a bully throughout his entire life. He bounced around in different high schools. He bounced around in different areas. He even was struggling in college. And I was just listening to this guy and his story. And I was like, no way that he's an NFL talent. No way he could handle the rigors of being an NFL player and just the mindset you need to have, not only kind of football IQ wise to be an offensive tackle, but just the day-to-day life and grind of being an NFL player. And it was no surprise to me that Garrett Bowles came out the gate and not only was he bad, but he was awful. I mean, he looked like a horrible bust of a first round pick, but flash forward to 2020, I heard a lot of stories about him putting in work, him really being self-reflective during quarantine, and my God, I was dead wrong about Garrett Bowles because he is phenomenal. He is one of the best offensive tackles in the entire NFL right now. I know he's going to be, again, 29 by the time his contract ends, his first contract, but he's no doubt going to get a huge second contract. He's been one of the biggest surprises in the entire NFL thus far. And I'm just really happy to see a guy drafted in the first round, really old compared to other first round players, doesn't start his career off well. And when you look at guys like that historically, they usually just phase out into existence and we never hear from them again. But Garrett Bowles, he loves football. He really wants to stick around. This guy's going to be playing well into his late 30s if he keeps playing how he's playing right now. And he's just been such a great surprise for the Denver Broncos.